The stage is set here at Wembley, a sea of fans beginning to descend upon the stadium for what ought to be a riveting Carabao Cup final. It's Manchester City, they face Liverpool, and it's coming up live on EA TV next. This is the time when the talking has to stop and the action finally begins. A warm welcome to Wembley from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson and we're just seconds away from kickoff time in what promises to be a wonderful Carabao Cup final. It is Manchester City taking on Liverpool. Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. But it wasn't a taxing save. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson between the posts. Kevin De Bruyne starts alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield and handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And let's see about the cross. Just wanted to get it out of there. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson begins in goal. Joe Gomez plays with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. Mohamed Salah plays with Diogo Jota on the flanks. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Well, trying to place it, but without any great success. Well, maybe went for the wrong technique. If he'd have hit it with power, he may have got a better result. That's a poor effort, really. Attacking possibilities on the flank for City here. And crossed in there. Well, not every player is capable of that sort of thing. Four marks for trying. Shame about the execution. Well, if you're the opposing defender, you've really got to keep a weather eye on Erling Haaland. What are you expecting to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, in many ways, he's a throwback to the 80s in the way he plays. He's so strong in holding up the play, he can outmuscle opponents. Today, the defenders will certainly know they've been in the battle. The referee has decided to give the free-kick decision the way of City. This is the home of live football, EA TV, and we'll have live coverage of the fifth round of the FA Cup. It's Manchester City taking on Liverpool. Well, we're down to the last 16 now, so plenty to play for in that game in what will be a tough encounter. McAllister. Gomez now. Liverpool unable to hold on to the ball. Foden. Andrew Robertson has lost the ball. It's a promising City move. Useful ball to the near post. Not away completely. Got to it easily, the keeper. City with the ball again. Salah. And with that, the attack fizzles out. This is the home of live football, EA TV. And we'll have live coverage of the fifth round of the FA Cup. It's Liverpool facing Manchester City. Well, only 16 teams left, so that game will be fiercely competitive. Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this! It's still alive! Danger averted for now. City could be onto something. Determined defending. Perhaps, and there it is. The hang on, the flag has gone up, and it's 
not going to count. Well, it was a close call, but he is just offside. Good finish, mind you. intercepted released it nicely again City have lost the ball Wataru Endo Darwin Nunez I think most defenders would expect to be booked halting an attack in that fashion And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. of stoppage time Alexis McAllister here's Robertson well that's wonderful attacking play and with that the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium second half and the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride that's effective pressure high up the pitch still can be dangerous now threat averted and a throw coming up after a really fine piece of tackling oh, not a good throw in at all terrific block the shots. position but dealt with defensively Andrew Robertson Conate here's Robertson and so 30 minutes left for play in this one Robertson can he play it in well I'm not sure the keeper particularly wanted that but danger averted for now
Foden. And after the cross, a tremendous block. And following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. minutes remaining Konate wilting under the pressure and now they try to go forward and foiled by Van Dijk Andrew Robertson free kick awarded to Liverpool and they will make the change now play on advantage Liverpool Gakpo and he's got the beating of his opponent that's a useful cross and it goes down as an own goal by the keeper Well, no question about this. As you can see, this will go down as an own goal. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. So Bosnoy. Andrew Robertson doesn't want to give it away here. Well, the final whistle soon to be sounded, but not quite yet. It's City with the lead. Stuart, how would you critique what you've seen from them? Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent, but they're going to need to be resilient in these final few minutes to get their much-deserved victory. Andrew Robertson Nunez and Dyke with it we might very well have late excitement here five minutes to go and just one goal between them oh what a very fine stop to keep them in this well it's a good save but time is running out for them here <laughs> substitution time it is here Perfect timing and great connection. What a goal that is. 
Robertson are back underway. 3-1 the score. Virgil van Dijk. Now options are plenty. Thiago. Gakpo. He got in the way of that cross. And the play, City throw. Ronaldo Silva. And it's whipped in early. And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. A Liverpool free kick coming up. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And the celebrations will be continuing long into the night. I think we can say that without any fear of contradiction. And it's great to celebrate with the fans. They've made so much noise here. They've got right behind their team. They certainly have, and the players greatly appreciate that. Always a joint effort on these big occasions. players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken well these photos will be cherished for years to come won't they certainly wants to show the grandchildren